This is Monty Hipsch from Aussie Web Conversion, and um, it's now January of 2010, and this is probably going to be one of the most important videos that you will watch this year. If you have a business that train, uh, trades from a physical location, in this video, I'm going to uh, make the argument and also show you how easy it is to add and or claim your business in Google's local business center. But first, let me just do an experiment for you. Let's say we're looking for a florist in Brisbane. So we put in florist Brisbane, we do a Google search, and, and look what we see here. That was our search. These three are sponsored listings, and these down the right-hand side are sponsored listings. But what you're seeing here with the map and the push pins actually doesn't come from sponsored listings, and it also does not come from the organic listings. These free organic listings come through very time-consuming and often expensive search engine optimization. But these listings, these free seven listings in the Google 7 pack, all come from Google Local Business Center and Google Maps. So how do you go about claiming your listing there? First of all, let me say that all listings in Google Maps and also to show up in that seven pack are a hundred percent free. So we go local business center uh, Google. That'll do. And of course, uh, the first listing here is Google, and it's called Google.com, uh, www.google.com local ad, and that's where you go. Now, you must have some form of Google account, uh, which are free, to be able to access the local business center. So if you already have a Gmail account or an account that you've set up um, because we've worked with you to set up Google Analytics, either of those will work to let you get in here. I already have uh, a local business center listing, so I will um, uh, just fill that form in and... Um, Bear with me a second and sign in. It, those center activities are 100% free. Now, here you can see that I already have claimed this listing and some other listings for other people. Um, and if you haven't claimed your listing, the data that's provided in the local business center is all provided from Google Yellow Pages. If you do not have a, a Yellow Page listing, it doesn't matter. When you go into the local business center, it will let you add your business. But this is my local business center listing. And as you can see, it allows me a lot of basic information here. Uh, we're in Australia. It's Aussie Web, my street address. It's Albion, Queensland, my phone number, a multi alternate number, email, website, description, categories. Uh, and I can have multiple categories, and you can add another one. So I have services, e commerce services, Internet marketing, business to business. Um, it actually creates a Google map here and locates my business on the map. This is the way the information will be displayed on the internet. I'm allowed to put in my, my hours of operations. Um, I'm allowed to uh, look at the payment types I take, cash, check, American Express, MasterCard, Visa, PayPal. I'm allowed to upload uh, an image, which I've done, which is a logo. You're also able to add more photographs, uh, which you can do from the web or from your own computer. And you're even allowed to have up to um, five YouTube videos. So you can link to videos as well. And you can put in additional categories, which I've provided, which is the area served, type of pricing, specialties, uh, estimates, been in business. All of these areas are available to you. And so you can see how it looks in real time over here on the uh, right-hand side. Now, when you go and do this, you'll have to claim your listing in the business center. Now, there's a number of ways to do that. So let's just for a second go back. The other way to get to the business center is to go through maps. So let me just for a second here go to maps.google.com.au. And you can search for yourself in maps. So here I'm going to search for Aussie Web. Uh, and I'll search the maps. And sure enough, there I am. And I can click on more information. And there's all the information that you just saw inside my system. Uh, I've got a reviews in here. I've got a coupon, 
I've got my maps. I can get directions to drive to and from from different locations. Here's a breakout of my hour of operations. Transit from public transport. So I've got that available. This is virtually my own um, mini web page. Um, and you have the exact same opportunity. Mine says owner verified listing. Yours, if you haven't claimed it, will say data provided most likely by yellow pages. And there'll be an, op an option to edit this page and you can click it and it'll come up and it'll say, are you the business owner? And it'll let you edit the page. Um, but it will ask for a verification and there are two ways you can verify your listing. One, you can verify it through a postcard from Mountain View, California, Google headquarters, which takes three to four weeks to get here with a PIN number. Or two, you can um, do it by telephone. I prefer the telephone, but it must be the telephone number that's going to be displayed in your listing. So if, when they do it, it's done by a robot. So if you put in your business number like I've done here, 32161001, and the person answering the phone isn't expecting a robot call from Google, they're going to hear, hi, this is Google Local Business Center. Your PIN number is dit 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 to confirm your listing, and they won't know what it is, and they won't write it down. So I suggest you use the phone, but make sure you are there. And it happens almost immediately, within a minute or two. So these are the Google business listings. Let's just go back for a second and uh, try our florist Brisbane again. And we'll see whether any of these um, um, have not a lot of information. So let's go to David Jones florists. And up it comes. See? Edit this place, business owner. All right. If you click on that, it tells you that that listing has not been claimed by the business listing. So you can edit my business information, suspend this listing, or this isn't my listing. And validating your listing by a PIN or an activation code. So in this case, that listing has not been claimed by the business owner. And in fact, if we scroll here, at some point we should see that the data is actually provided by, yeah, the business listings provided by Yellow Pages. So if you're in Yellow Pages, that's the way um, um, you can start. And then you can, you know, this is David Jones, and they, they haven't claimed their listing. What's the matter? Um, they could add pictures, videos, all sorts of stuff. And there's Street View. Um, so you should do this for your business. Um, there are some rules. Don't try to prank the system. Don't. You need to have a physical street address because this is about local businesses and they're interested in being able to see pictures and locations. So do it. Do it properly. Do it correct. Um, but definitely claim your business. Um, this work is a very, very powerful tool. You'll get traffic. You'll be found in Google Maps. You'll be found in regular Google organic searches, just like we saw here. Um, well, this was in Maps. If we go back to um, google.com.au uh, you know you can search for dentists um, um, aspley qld and there it is these are all free 100 percent free it doesn't look like any of these have been claimed there's so little dentist here if we go and look for some more information there we go. See, business owner hasn't been claimed. So this individual has the opportunity to have all sorts of marketing information, hours of operations, things that will help them get um, people to find them. This information also shows up on mobile devices. So if people are using smartphones, an iPhone or an Android phone or a BlackBerry, they can do these searches on their phone. And this same information comes up here. It comes from the local business center and from maps. This is all free, 100% free traffic. If you don't claim your listing in Google Maps when you don't upgrade it and add more information and get some reviews and add a coupon so that you always come up here in the top seven for free, I don't know why you're in business. Um, if you need some help with this, please give us a call. I'm happy to talk to you about it. That's not a problem. But make sure you claim your listing in Google Maps and Google Locals Business Center. Thanks, and I hope you have a great 2010. Bye.